We begin tonight with a developing story. Police continue to investigate a credit card skimming scam that occurred at a local big box retailer earlier this month. This one could potentially affect hundreds of people and the police say they need victims to come forward. 2822 News reporter I.E. Jine live in the newsroom with the latest on that story. I.E. With the holiday season coming up, you could be a victim of skimming. It's likely that you could be a victim of skimming. Investigators working on the latest scam in Luzerne County say it can happen anywhere, from an ATM to a gas pump or even a self-checkout register. The individuals who placed the skimming device at the Walmart in Wilkesbury Township have been identified and are now being charged. We have identified two of the three suspects in this skimming ring. They are a national skimming ring. They are from Romania. I know there are at least nine people in this crew. I've talked to the state police here in Pennsylvania. Um, they're investigating. The FBI has gotten involved. With the holiday season around the corner, Detective Caporell tells 2822 News it's very likely that we will be seeing an increase in scams such as this. We have such a large business base that they're always hitting Wilkesbury Township with the credit card fraud, the counterfeit money, all that stuff. This is all counterfeit cash. We get a lot of counterfeits. See all the serial numbers are the same? A normal bill, mm -hmm. crumple up like this. You can go like this. It, would it won't work. rip. Uh -huh. It's made of linen. That's paper. If you used this self-checkout between September 6th and September 18th, police urge you to check your bank statements. If you suspect you have been a victim of skimming, file a report immediately. They'll come here, they'll make their report, um, and what we'll do is we'll backtrack the date and when the card was last used at the Walmart and see if it's part of this. If it is, then we're going to charge the, uh, the suspects we have identified with access device fraud and more stuff because they stole the credit card numbers here. Until anyone comes forward. All we can charge is possession of a uh, skimming device and attempt to commit theft by deception. Detective Caporal says if you find you have been a victim of any type of credit card fraud, the first thing you should do is close the account. Then run a credit check on yourself to make sure that your identity was not also stolen in the process. Although it's not likely that you will have your identity stolen from this crew, it is better to be safe than sorry. In the newsroom, Ai Jang, 2822 News. Always trying to stay one step ahead of mm -hmm. the bad guys, as usual. All right, Ai, thank you.